on the day I saw you. I really, really want to catch your eye. There's something special about you. And I must really like you. Cause not a lot of guys are worth my time. Oh, Ooh, baby, baby, baby. It's getting kind of crazy. Cause you are taking over my mind. And it feels like. Hello Aries, so this is your weekly reading. I'm going to be starting with the tarot. Okay, so universe, what's going to happen with Aries? And the first one that will be on Aries' mind. So there is the Page of Cups. Okay, this could be a new offer. This could be an apology as well. Let's see what I'm getting. Universe, the person that will be on Aries' mind. What would this person like to say? Ace of Wands, Universe. Six of Cups. Oh, okay. This is someone from someone from the past. Yeah, that's why the Ace came out reverse. Six of Cups upright. So this is someone from the past. They want to apologize to you. They're gonna be sending you a message. Universe, the person that will be on Aries line. What will this person keep hidden from Aries? Hangman. Hey, okay, what they keep hidden. This would be someone that um, is stuck on you. You probably didn't know that they were stuck on you. Probably because they haven't communicated. Um, initiate communication. But now they're doing so. Universe, the person will be on Aries' line. How will this person feel about Aries? Two of Pentacles. They're not too sure if you're going to respond back, answer their call. Universe, the person that will be on Aries' mind. What are this person's true feelings for Aries? The Hermit. Yes. They can't get you off their mind. Universe, the person that will be on Aries' mind. What are this person's intentions with Aries? Not a source to communicate. Universe, the person that will be on Aries' mind. What action will this person take? Five of Cups, Ten of Wands. Apology, Confession okay especially how they truly feel so you are going to hear from this person okay um universe cut for the hangman the devil yeah see this person was withholding communication probably thought this person was over you no they're coming back universe cut for the devil universe cut for the devil five pentacles yeah and also i feel like they are going through something financially as well that's what I'm seeing. Um, so you're going to hear from this person. This person could be a Virgo, a Pisces, Cancer, Gemini, Capricorn. Okay. Or a Scorpio. So let's see. Let's look here. Universe, give me a few cards, but I don't have to just see you have for Aries. Universe, give me two more cards. I don't have to just see you have for Aries. Universe, give me one more card. I don't have to just see you have for Aries. Okay. Okay. Universe, give me a few cards, but I don't have to just see you have for Aries. Universe, give me two more cards. Universe, give me one more card. Okay, so first position, there is, oops. There is a woman dealing or relationship with a woman, and then there is shield. You need to defend yourself. Okay, they might still be connected to someone. I will clarify that. Then there is horse short journey, and then there is a ring. A marriage will take place either romantic or business. Probably this connection was short lived. Okay, it was really left unfinished. Okay, while this person is still connected to someone else. Well, family wishes coming true. Lily, spiritual love. And then skills, keep your life in balance. So this is them trying to express how they feel, like how they have the same emotions. They want to balance things out with you. But I don't like this position though. Which bone a wish is granted. This is someone that you want to come back. They're going to come back. This person could be Aquarius or Pisces. I was getting a lot of Pisces energy in the tarot. February. Some of you guys have broken up um, with this person since February. Universe, clarify um, woman. Universe, clarify woman. Bear, danger, especially in money matters. Probably they're with someone because it's much better for them financially. They, this person could be married and they want to still 
protect their finances. That's why they sell with that person. Okay. So let's see what else I'm getting. I'm also going to be doing all signs. This should be towards the middle of this video. Let's look here. Okay, so universe, give me a few cards, but I don't also just see you have for Aries. So there's higher power. Then there is exchanging gifts. Universe, give me one more card. Then there is yin. A lot of pink. Okay, change in the wind. Um, I feel like a lot of you guys have been glowing, like leveling up. You've been looking extremely good. This person definitely see your beauty. You guys are really connected to your divine feminine energy. Some of you guys are connecting with your Arisha, with your spirit, okay? Your divine feminine spirits. Let's see what else I'm getting. Okay. Universe, give me a three card spread. Yeah, it's me I've been connecting with a spirit of love, okay? Or you did, and this person's coming back. So I see someone who you want to come back, they're going to be coming back. Seven of Cups. Universe, give me two more cards. Three of Cups, the world. Yeah. And then obstacle and challenges. So this person's going to be trying to fight for you, this connection. But again, <laughs> the other part, I don't like how it's true that they're still connected to someone. So Universe, give me a big card spread. What messages do you have for Aries? Grove. Universe, give me two more cards. Conclusion. Um, Queen of Swords and the Self-Worth card. And then there's Fragments. So, yeah, this could have been someone who puts you through a lot with the Grove and Conclusion and that Self-Worth card. You got to cut them off with the Queen of Swords and Fragment. Um, yeah, I'm getting that. Let's look here. Um, universe, you might meet them at the mall as well, too. Or when you're traveling, like randomly, you might meet them there. Universe, give me a three card spread. Single, repentance. So this person might try to come off like they're single. Tower, and Sagittarius. Let me drink some water. Probably this is someone who moved. And they're going to be moving to your city. That's what I'm getting universe or that's you universe cup at the tower money opportunity but before i showed that it was struggling though it's the universe cup at money opportunity mirror effect and no matter what happens outside myself I, I know that i'm safe so this person's trying to get back to where they used to be financially okay um so there's high power seven of cups and growth okay um you always need to know this person's gonna come back Okay, um, you do have other options here. A changing gifts, the three of cups, and conclusion. Again, I feel like this person might still be connected to so with someone. So just make sure if you're interested in them, make sure um, you really get the tea on them. Then there's Yen, which is the divine feminine energy, the world, Queen of Swords, and self worth. I feel like we're trying to say if this person did put you through hell and back, choose you. Okay, don't repeat stuff because it's familiar or you want to feel certain emotions again or feel a certain way again, okay? If this person puts you through hell and back, choose you, continue to move forward. Um, this whole month, especially in October too, because October is Libra, Libra's love energy and is and Mercury retrograde in Libra, you gotta really um, check your emotions and see if it's the most logical thing for you to act upon, okay? That's what I'm gonna hear. Change the wind, obstacles and challenges and fragment. Okay. This might this might throw you off a little bit. Some of you guys probably thought you move on from this person emotionally, but when they come back, probably you're gonna feel away about them. Okay. So let's look at the other deck. Oh, let's look at the Capra deck and I'm gonna go to the all signs. Oh, 
All right, universe, give me a few cards, but I don't want to just see you have four Aries. So there is toy and labor and thief. Universe, give me one more card. What message do you have for Aries? Universe, give me one more card. What message do you have for Aries? So there is mature woman and marriage. Some of you guys are in another relationship too. <laughs> so when this person resurfaces, I feel like you're going to do the right thing. You're not going to get too caught up with messy situation, okay? But I do see someone who you wanted, to, want, always wanted to come back is going to resurface, okay? So let's look at the all signs. We're going to be starting with your fellow Aries. Okay, so universe, what's going to happen with Aries and Aries? What's going to happen with Aries and Aries? Two of Pentacles, okay? So, with this person, probably both of you guys will know really where the future has between you guys, okay? You know what's going to happen between Aries and Aries, like together. Dolphin, financial gain usually coming from something you did in the past. You know what's going to happen with Aries and Aries? Tunnel, appear frustration, lessons to be learned. Yeah, so I feel like you're just trying to say this person's gonna come back again, but I feel like we're trying to say, like, this lesson, whatever you experienced before, it might repeat again if you were to entertain this, okay? So let's look at um, Taurus. Okay, so, universe, what's going to happen? with Aries and Taurus. Universe is going to happen with Aries and Taurus. Eight of Wands, they're gonna initiate communication. Universe is going to happen with Aries and Taurus. Claw, be careful, do not take risks. Wow. It's trying to say for those who are tempted by a Taurus, it's best to just ignore than to communicate. Because you might be back with this person even though you're trying to move on. Universe is going to happen with Aries and Taurus. Rainbow. The most difficult part of the situation is over. Okay. So some of you guys will eventually um, successfully move on from this person. But I do see a test. Let's look at um, Gemini. Universe is going to happen with Aries and Gemini. The strength card. Okay. It's about willpower. So... Universe is going to happen with Aries and Gemini. Bat, take care. Enemies are working against you. Wow. So, yeah, you guys are not even wanting to be. That's weird because someone that you wanted to come back who could be a Gemini. So, in the past, you wanted them to come back. But now, like, you don't want them anymore because, like, you see the situation exactly for what it is. Like, you're not seeing things with rose colored glasses. Glasses. Then there's Mountain Road. You want to road to success. You feel like you're better without this person now okay or you just remember the drama let's look at cancer okay so universe what's going to happen with aries and cancer the magician you the balls in your court you got the power universe is going to happen with aries and cancer Okay, so there is cane, pay attention to your health, and crack cup, dissociation, and life, okay? Um, I got multiple message here. I feel like what I was trying to say, um, make sure you are watching your vibration, okay? If you have not been, even if you have been dealing with this person less than six months, even, because this, I feel like this could be like a long time ago, just be careful with this cancer. This cancer might have a CD. This cancer just might have bad luck too. Okay, so ties are real. So just be careful. That's what I'm getting here. Universe is going to happen with Aries and Cancer. Universe is going to happen with Aries and Cancer. Broken ring, yeah. So this person is going to be with the BS, parting of ways either romantic or business. So it's best to just leave things. How it, how it was before, basically, not to open that chapter again. Okay, let's look at Leo. 
So universe is going to happen with Aries and Leo. Universe is going to happen with Aries and Leo. Six of Swords and the Two of Cups. This could have been someone who was like acting like a runner. Okay. They're going to be coming back to you. Something they probably chose the wrong person too. Like they chose wrong and they want to come back. Universe is going to happen with um, Aries and Leo. So there is um, goldfish, increase in material wealth and, or spiritual prosperity and wealth. Hmm. Part of this person felt like when they was with you, things were much better in their life. Universe is going to happen with um, Aries and Leo. Nest and emotionally secure love and family is important to you. Some of you guys have a child together or children together. I feel like they want to have that nuclear family again. Okay. So I feel like they're more serious this time. Let's look at um, Virgo. So universe is going to happen with Aries and Virgo. Judgment. They want another chance. Okay, so universe is going to happen with Aries and Virgo. Okay, so there is Rose. Romance is in the air. So I feel like this is them coming to a realization that they was never over you, that they had deeper feelings. This could be someone who was trying to downplay the feelings that they had for you. Universe is going to happen with Aries and Virgo. Final period of frustration, lessons to be learned. So they learned their lesson. Okay, let's look at... Um, Libra. Okay, right. universe. What's going to happen with Aries and Libra? Seven of Pentacles. This person always was invested, always think about you. Let's see what else I'm getting. Universe is going to happen with Aries and Libra. V, victory and some endeavor. This person initial can start with the V or... Okay, last um, letter initial, last name initial, so with a V2 or middle name. A okay, universe is going to happen with Libra and what's going to happen with Aries and Libra? Okay, so there is grasshopper situation balance that requires careful handling. This could have been someone who was a serial monogamous. So this Libra cat has Scorpio energy as well, Scorpio placements. They thought the grass was green on the other side. It wasn't, they feel like this relationship was the most successful relationship that they had. And I feel like this person wanted to see if you guys can repeat that again. Let's look at Scorpio. Okay. Universe is going to happen with Aries and Scorpio. Eight of Pentacles. So now they want to put in the work. Universe is going to happen with Aries and Scorpio. Universe is going to happen. So there it's a success to shore with good plans and hard work. Yeah, so now they really count on the hard work for you. Okay. So there is tree. This could be someone you have a family with, affairs with your family, and gavel involvement with the law. Uh I don't like this energy. Because it's not with pure heart, pure intentions. If you have a child with this person, this person will try to act right because they don't want to be on child support or they're thinking that you will, will take them off of child support. Okay? That's what I'm going to hear. If you don't have a family with this person, um, this person might have a baby that's on the way or I don't know. They just feel like it's more smarter to be connected to you. It's not with pure intentions. Okay? Let's look at... Um, Let's look at Sagittarius. Universe is going to happen with Aries and Sag. Six of Swords. So this person looks like a runner too. A universe is going to happen with Aries and Sagittarius. Rabbit, too much concern with sexual matters. So this person might try to approach you on a sexual um, note as well as sexual energy. Jug, lighthearted, carefree time. They're still the same. So it, it's best, if you're not looking into just casual thing is best to just disconnect because they're not interested for commitment yep it's best to let go um casket someone's going out your life or end of situation so let's look at capricorn okay so universe is going to happen with aries and capricorn 
All right, Five of Swords. This Capricorn play games a lot. Let's see what games they play. The universe is going to happen with Aries and Capricorn. What's going to happen with Aries and Capricorn? So, bird flying news is on the way. The universe is going to happen with Aries and Capricorn. Oh, so many cards. <laughs> Let's see. Tank hard, celebration, fun, enjoyment, hills, obstacles to overcome, cheer filled, someone new is into your life, and then there is our good advice from a wise person. Um, I got multiple messages here. <laughs> okay. So with Capricorn, if your ex is a Capricorn, they want to know what's been going on with you. They've been nosy, okay? This person want to know if your life got better or not without them. Um, if you have moved on, if you have found love, okay? Um, they just being nosy. Now, if this is a new Capricorn, this person have a cynical vibe to them, okay? Cynical vibe. But Aries can match Capricorn energy too. I don't know. This is a weird, <laughs> it's weird. I'm saying, I'm not saying it, it can't work because I feel like it can because I feel like you guys can like match each other energy a little bit. It just, this person is just a cynical, okay? They're not going to be that like gentle man or that gentle woman, okay? So let's look at Aquarius. So universe is going to happen with Aries and Aquarius. Eight of Pentacles. So the Eight of Pentacles keep coming out. So this Aquarius trying to put in the work. Universe is going to happen with Aries and Aquarius. Bell announcement. Universe is going to happen with Aries and Aquarius. There is dark man dealing a relationship with a man with dark complexion or hair. So yeah, this person is trying to really improve, like impress you, improve whatever they need to improve on. Okay, and put in the hard work. Okay, this have better intentions than the Scorpio because this card came out for Scorpio too. So let's look at Pisces. So universe, what's going to happen with Aries and Pisces? Okay, that card wanna come out there, energy. <laughs> Magician. Okay, so it's so funny how the Pisces High Priestess card wanted to come out, but it didn't. But your card came out. So that means like you the boss in your court, you have the power in this dynamic, okay? Universe is going to happen with Aries and Pisces. So there is frying pan trouble accusation. So we guys are just gonna have this talk with them. I just for like your own clarity to have your own clarity universe is going to happen with Aries and Pisces and then there is door opportunities are waiting for you universe clarified door will indecisiveness allowing your life to aim um, to ramble aimlessly okay yeah so you guys are just gonna probably have a talk and then just to as clarity for clarity purposes and just move on because you know this person's not serious okay so that's the reading that i have for you aries thank you guys for watching my video and subscribing if this video resonates you can definitely book a personal reading with me at me for the tarot at gmail.com